All right, Chicago Bear fans. Justin Fields is a Chicago Bear, and the majority of people are very happy. And why not? Once again, we have a quarterback, and we have tremendous hope in them, hoping that this is the one that is a future Hall of Famer and will lead us to a Super Bowl or two or three or four. But, as always, we shall see. So happy to have Justin Fields. We give up a first round 20 pick. And next year, we're going to give up a really good first round pick. And we give up some fifth rounders and fourth rounders. So the Giants, they didn't do too bad on this. Um, Now, if Justin Fields turns out to be a Hall of Famer, then they're going to regret it. But other than that, they did pretty well because next year that pick is going to be really good. And I'll show you why. When you look at the Bears schedule for next year, they don't have the days they'll play, but just look at the schedule. Let's be honest. How many wins do you see? All right. Detroit. That's one win. If Aaron Rodgers is with green Bay, that's a loss. Um, You're playing Minnesota at home. Let's be generous. That's two wins. You're playing the Cardinals. That's a loss. Playing the 49ers, that could be a loss. Ravens, that's a loss. Bengals, you should win. So that's, what, three wins? The Giants, you should win. That's four wins. Um, That's a loss to the Browns. At Detroit, that's five wins. You should win that game without Matthew Stafford there anymore. Um, Green Bay, that's a loss. At the Rams, that's a loss. At Minnesota, a loss. At Steelers, a loss. At Seattle, a loss. At Tampa Bay, a loss. And then at Raiders, a loss. Because why not? So you're looking at a five-win season at most. At most, five wins. No matter who's quarterback. So, Because there's no way, I don't care, there's no way Justin Fields is going to come in and just dominate and lead the team to the playoffs. I I mean, that would be, you want to talk about shocking. That would be beyond a shock. I just don't see it. So a lot of people think Justin Fields is going to come in, start right away, and just dominate. Not going to happen. Remember, Matt Nagy, he was in Kansas City, and he's seen how Andy Reid did um, Patrick Mahomes, how he was patient with him. He let them observe and practice and see how it goes. And they benefited from it. And they also seen what happened when Mitch Trubisky got here and they threw him in. So I think they're going to just play Andy Dalton. The fans will be irate, but that's okay. And Justin Fields will be in the meeting rooms learning how to watch film like a professional learning how professionals practice, how they prepare, just getting used to the NFL lifestyle and being a Chicago Bear quarterback with all the hopes and dreams upon you. And um, when will he start to start? I would think at best towards the end of the year, at best. But most likely their best case scenario He plays next year. He starts day one next year. I know people don't want to hear that, but do you really want a rookie quarterback? Do you really want them to play all these games against these tough teams and get blown out, get beat, and then have them have like, you know, a little, he may feel like a loser losing all these games. Um, That could be, I mean, it could be a little damaging to the psyche. Could make him question himself. Man, do I suck? Look at all these losses we have. So I don't know. It's going to be interesting to see how the Bears play this. So the question is, will Justin Fields be a future Hall of Famer? Because as a Chicago Bear fan, I'm telling you, anything less, I don't want to hear about it. I don't want a average quarterback. I don't want a game manager. I don't want a quarterback who makes the Pro Bowl because the 12 other quarterbacks decline to go. 
I want someone special. I want my Aaron Rodgers. I want my Joe Montana. I want my Tom Brady. We haven't had that. We deserve it. So when you see the Bears get Justin Fields at first, you're like, yes, nice, nice. But then you start to think, wait a minute, the Chicago Bears drafted him. And then all of a sudden you start to think, when's the last time the Chicago Bears did anything right in the first round in the first round of a draft? Let alone when have they done anything right with a quarterback? Never. So first round quarterback, the Chicago Bears, that's never gone right. And so it's like, man, what's going to happen? What is going to happen? Is the curse of the Chicago Bears picking a quarterback going to continue? Or is this our breakthrough? Is this our miracle? Will Justin Fields be that winning quarterback? Will he be our Hall of Fame quarterback? We're going to find out. And it's all going to happen this coming season. I think we'll see him play some. But Andy Dalton, QB1, you don't have a lot of time. And Justin Fields is coming for you. So if Justin Fields is as good as we hope, I I hope he does start before the year's over. And I hope he does show us something. But we'll see, though. We will see. I'm happy to have him. Um, They had Mac Jones and Justin Fields available. And obviously, I'm taking Justin Fields over Mac Jones. But he went to the New England Patriots, I'm sure. Um, He'll groom him into whatever. Maybe another Tom Brady. Who knows? But we got Justin Fields. And um, I'm happy with that. So. But we're going to see what happens, though. We're going to see. So anyway, let me know what are your thoughts on Justin Fields. Do you think he's going to be our Tom Brady, our Aaron Rodgers? Or do you think he's just going to be another nothing, just another nobody? We're going to find out for sure, though. But anyway, that's all.